Hmm. So Torkoal couldn't uh, couldn't provide us with many answers. That's too bad. Oh, that's not entirely true. We know that we need proof, and knowing that is a step forward, right? Hey, hey, we're searching too. Yeah, but we didn't find anything. But there's no giving up. We have to keep trying, by golly. I'll keep trying too. We should have dinner and rest up for the night. We'll resume our efforts tomorrow. Oh, well, thanks everyone. We're not making as much progress as we'd hoped. When we talked with Torkoal, I started thinking we had hope. I wonder how Grovile's doing. Has he gathered the time gears? We need to hurry too. But there's no point in getting all flustered, especially since everyone is helping out. We should get some sleep. Then start with fresh resolve tomorrow. Okay, you. Good night. The next morning. Up and at him. It's morning. Uh, good morning, you. Him. So in short, the hidden land remains shrouded in mystery, but we're not giving up. Hooray. Let's get out there and investigate again today. Let's go, everyone. Hooray, once again. Where should we go investigate today, you? But we've already talked to Torkoal. We're out of leads. Pokemon detected. Pokemon detected. Whose footprint? Whose footprint? The footprint belongs to Torkoal, the town elder. The footprint belongs to Torkoal, the town elder. What? Torkoal's here? Ah. Ah. Finally, I caught up with you. Climbing up to this guild is hard on these old bones. What brings you here, Torkoal? Did you... maybe remember something? Indeed I did. But I've recalled only one more tiny thing, sorry to say. Yesterday I contemplated the waters of the hot spring for a long time. Finally one recollection surfaced. But it really is something small. I worry if it would be even worthwhile sharing with you. Not a worry. Every little bit of information helps, however small. Please say it. Say it! When we spoke of travel to the Hidden Land yesterday, I said that you needed a proof of qualification to go there. I remembered a bit more about that proof. The proof bears an inscription of a certain pattern. A certain pattern? Hey, hey, so what kind of pattern would that be? Uh, how can I describe it? It's difficult to describe. But I can tell you that the pattern is quite intricate and odd. It's a peculiar pattern, the kind of pattern you rarely see. A pattern you rarely see? Golly. You'd think I could think of something. But trying to think of such a thing, it's not easy when one tries. Hmm, what could it be? That kind of pattern you rarely see. Why does that seem familiar? What could a pattern like that look like? Pattern you rarely see. Peculiar... Wait a second! A peculiar pattern? A peculiar pattern! I remember that time! So one day, I happened to come across my relic fragment. 
I admit that it looks like junk, but take a closer look. See? That inscription forms a strange pattern, doesn't it? It's true. There is a strange inscription. I've never seen a pattern like this. That's it! The relic fragment was inscribed with a peculiar pattern. Hmm? What is it, you? What? My relic fragment? Oh, right! That pattern! Excuse me, could you have a look at this? Oh, this is it. It's a pattern exactly like this. What? Where, where did you get this? Well, I'm not sure if I can remember. I just happened to pick it up one day. You know, searching around the backyard of my parents' guild. It was odd finding it. Like I knew it would be there. Yippee, this is fabulous. Since Forrest has this, does it mean that Forrest is qualified to go to the Hidden Land? That I wouldn't know. Maybe yes, maybe no. To go to the Hidden Land, one must surely possess that proof. But that doesn't necessarily mean that the bearer of the proof really possesses the qualifications to be chosen. That proof may be merely the physical key to the Hidden Land. Even before that, though, this shares the same inscribed pattern. There's no sure connection between this relic fragment and the Hidden Land. Oh, but... There's no question that this pattern has something to do with the Hidden Land. Knowing only that is a lot. I suppose so. Wait. You do realize that the Hidden Land is only a spoken legend, right? You're surely not trying to find this place. Yes, we are. My goodness. What a surprise. Chat up. This pattern. We've seen this somewhere, haven't we? What? what? Yes. The sea inlet to the northwest. Inside Brine Cave. Guildmaster, that place! Yes, I know. That a vicious bandit was there. A vicious... Bandit? By golly! Everyone, please listen. I once saw the same pattern deep inside the place called Brian Cave. I think we can discover more by taking the relic fragment there. However, there is one problem. A Pokemon lurks there who is a vicious bandit. Hey, hey, we're not about to let that scare us. Aren't we explorers? We all need to be brave. Thanks, everyone. But that place is challenging. Everyone should take time today to get ready. We'll set off for Brian Cave tomorrow. Hooray! Ho, ho, ho! I thought that the Hidden Land was nothing more than folklore. Getting old has made my thinking so inflexible. That's very sad. This all makes me remember the days when I dreamt of romance and adventure. Help me see my dreams again. Do your best, ho oh, ho. Oh. Yes, you can count on us. Thank you, Torco. Oh, it was nothing, ho oh, oh, ho oh. ho. All right, everyone. Spend the rest of today getting ready. Okay, dismissed. Hooray! Yep, yep, we'll get ready, by golly. Oh my gosh, this will be so exciting. Shut up. Shut up. You're set at the guild tomorrow on standby. Guildmaster! Forgive me if I'm out of line, but please let me go to Brian Cave. Nope, I can't let you face danger like that ever again. But that's why. That's why I must go. Please take me to Brian Cave. Okay. Then I want you to go with Team Legends tomorrow. Guide your team to the place where we saw that strange pattern. But I want you to be careful. 
thank you. I won't let you down. Another thing. I have something I need to do, so I have to go out. You're in charge while I'm gone. As you wish. So that's where it stands. You two will be with me tomorrow. As such, Team Legends, non-guild members may not come along. Brian Cave has a vicious foe lying in wait. You mustn't let your guard down. And don't do anything that keeps me from succeeding there. Uh, okay. You. Let's go get ready. Let's go to Treasure Town. Right after we talk to Krogon. Meh. <laughs> Tomorrow I'm going to. Brian K. Meh. <laughs> Alright. So what exclusive items? Stop showing up with Valiant Rock. I need Lucario stuff. Huh. You two go on ahead to Treasure Town and get ready. When another apprentice comes back, I'll get them to cover for me while I get geared up. It's tomorrow that we set off for Brian Cave. The whole guild is going, and you two will personally accompany me to when we explore. As such, you may not bring non-guild members of Team Legend. Understood? Now I must insist that you two not slow me down. So I expect you to fully stock up with supplies in Treasure Town. Get prepared. Of course we will. Oh, to be young again. If I was younger, I'd certainly join the challenge to find the hidden land. Whoa ho ho. Hold it there, old timer. Uh, who is it? What is it? What do you want? <laughs> well, we're Team Skull. <laughs> Did you have business with Wigglytuff's guild, old timer? Whoa ho ho! I overheard you saying something that sounded fun. Something about the hidden land. <laughs> I... I was only... Heh, <laughs> someone's coming. Whoa ho ho! Guild chumps? Old timer, why don't we take this chat somewhere we won't be disturbed? <laughs> hey! Unhand me! Alright, just a quick check of this. Not too much I want to do on there, and for this, also not too much. The guild seems to be buzzing with purpose these days. The Hidden Land? No, I can't say I've heard of it. However, there's that's the sort of name that gets an explorer's pulse pounding. Oh, the Hidden Land. The planet will be paralyzed if something's not done. We'd offer to help. But being motivated isn't really our thing. Getting excited over the planet's paralysis takes too much effort. So first things first, we're going into here, talking to Magnazone. All right, and to spend a cafe because I do believe, yes, I do have an orange gummy. Ooh, good feeling. IQ went up, learn non-sleeper, yes, yes. This, okay, this is great. IQ increased again, perfect. Okay, so. Uh, with non-sleeper, the Pokemon resists sleep inflicted on it from traps and enemy moves. So not complete immunity, but still. Okay, ooh, a new offer. This offer ends today, don't miss it. Ooh, 
Okay, I will recycle for that. Yeah, so with special offers, you can only select that and you can choose whether or not to take the offer or not. Oh, damn it, I should have I should have stocked up. So when I kept going into the dungeon, I only ever got orange berries and escape orbs. I forgot you can trade the escape orbs for reviver seeds. I will quickly trade uh, for a gold ticket, though. And that's mostly so that then I can get rid of... Uh, the escape orbs are fine to stay because those can go into something I really like. Like four... All... <laughs> Just eight max elixirs because I don't need that many. Blue. It has let me down several times. Oh, you jerk. You got our hopes up. Okay, cleanse orb, that's fine. And yes, our inventory is full, so... Uh, yeah, I'll sell the bands. Open the box, deposit the money, talk to everyone. Did not mean to buy. Need to sell. Might as well sell the Geo Pebbles as well. Now I can check what you have for sale. Uh. Another orange gummy. Perfect. Alright, now to talk to everyone. Yo, I heard. The planet's going to be paralyzed if nothing's done? That's bad news. Bad, bad, bad. Hey, I believe too. I believe in you. We've never heard anything about the Hidden Land, but if anyone can find it, I'm sure you can. Go for it. I believe what she said. After all, it's very strange that time hasn't started moving again after the time gears were put back. I'm in your corner. I hope you succeed. The horrible enemies within Brian Cave. What do you suppose they are? Eek. Thinking about them frightens me. I'm getting kitted out to prepare to go to Brian Cave. <laughs> okay, Zatu. What's in this box? Okay, Roost. Does not matter. Time to deposit all my stuff. Alright. And I could check the purple Kecleon, but... Yeah, no, I should. I should. Okay, what do you have? Nothing that I want. Seriously, Aura Sphere or Drain Punch. Either of those would be perfect. Alright, so I have the Orange Gummy and a protein to use. The orange gummy is going to that. Okay, yeah, I don't have any eggs currently in there. All right, you. We should go over to Sharpedo Bluff before we go back to the guild, just in case Groviles come back. Let's go check out Sharpedo Bluff, you. Oh yes, I completely forgot about that. And we should talk to everyone else. I hear the whole guild's off to Brian Cave. Best of luck to you. The whole world's time is about to stop. We came running when we heard the world's in danger. I tell you, this is no time to be soaking in the hot spring. So, we come, but what are we supposed to do now? Hey, hey, Brian Cave has some nasty enemies on the loose. Everyone better be... Uh, everyone better get stocked up with proper equipment, hey, hey. Uh, hey, Murkra, uh, Marowak, anything else? Okay, nothing. Good to know. Yeah, let's go check on Sharpedo Bluffs.